The Workers' Party, PT, of Brazil will present a formal petition to initiate an impeachment against the far-right President Jair Bolsonaro for his mismanagement in the face of the health crisis that the country is going through due to COVID-19. But what about the PT? Finally that crazy guy is so detestable that as a foreigner I hate him and I don't even live in Brazil. This is the best TL, DR I could make, original, https colon slash slash www. Telesuranglish. Net slash news slash Brazilian Workers Party asked to impeachment against Bolsonaro 20200516-0009. HTML, reduced by 70%. I'm a bot. The Workers' Party of Brazil will present a formal petition to initiate an impeachment against the far-right President Jair Bolsonaro for his mismanagement in the face of the health crisis that the country is going through due to COVID-19. In a statement, the left-wing party reported that its executive commission decided to submit to the Chamber of Deputies a collective impeachment petition against President Jair Bolsonaro. Bolsonaro no longer works with this government, added Hoffman, who announced the lawsuit along with the party leader in the lower house, Enyo Vary, and the minority leader in Congress Jose Gamariz. Extended Summary, http colon slash slash np. Reddit. com slash r slash auditor slash comments slash glrgg1 slash the underscore workers underscore party underscore pt underscore of underscore brazil underscore will underscore present underscore a slash faq http colon slash slash np reddit com slash r slash auditor slash comments slash 31 b 9 fm slash faq underscore auditor underscore bot slash version 2 0 2 488700 TL, DRS so far. Feedback, http colon slash slash np, reddit. com slash message slash compose, 2 equals percent 23 auditor PMs and comments are monitored, constructive feedback is welcome. Top keywords, President carrot hashtag one Bolsonaro carrot hashtag two party carrot hashtag three country carrot hashtag four impeachment carrot hashtag five. Don't forget him allowing the rainforest to burn. I'll upvote, cause it's another challenge to these authoritarian bullshit weak men who cheated, lied, and continue to grip their ignorant marks. The Workers' Party of Brazil are kind of shit, but I love how the mere mention of them triggers all the fash on here. I am not sure on why this is making international news and the other over 30 petitions for Bolsonaro's impeachment, https colon slash slash www. Metropoles. Com slash Brazil slash Politica Brazil slash com 31 Petidos de impeachment Bolsonaro supercolor Itamar e FHC, didn't. Anyhow. The killer petition will probably come by just after the shit that former minister Moro threw at the fan, https colon slash slash www al jazeera com slash news slash 2020 slash 05 slash brazil bolsonaro caught video pushing swap police chief 20051302035885 html becomes public traditionally when a Brazilian president is being cooked the Congress lets dozens of petitions accumulate until there's enough political momentum to conduct the process successfully. Here in South Africa we're starting to see a lot of malnutrition and other consequences from the lockdown. For a poor country like Brazil it is a very different decision than somewhere like Norway. But again, I think Jair Bolsonaro is doing a horrible job because he's basically denying it. Removed. What's the Brazilian equivalent of falling out of windows? Always some top minds supporting Bolsonaro and screaming about communists in these kind of threads. America was rooting for this guy and forced Lula out. FYI, Telesur is a joke of a news company owned by Cuba and Venezuela. Deserves worse than an impeachment. Man, communists just love to seize power without a vote. Doesn't the president of Brazil have more power than the president of countries like America? How likely is this to actually make any change? I don't expect Redditors to understand how shutting down the economy in South America is a horrible, horrible idea. There would be actual food shortages, mass unemployment, with no way to support themselves, 
and these already indebted nations would have to take on more loans to keep their shit running. Basically what happened to Venezuela in 2013. Impeachments are easy to win. I'd hope for them that image wasn't recent. Can't really bitch about someone's mismanagement of a pandemic when you're nut to butt with hundreds of people not wearing masks. I have a Brazilian friend who's in the US to get his master's degree, you do not want to get him started on Bolsonaro, he really fucking hates him, thinks he's basically the Pol Pot of Brazil. That he completely ignores anyone with a brain between their ears and is working with the Russians to destroy Brazil, there's no such thing as democracy anymore. No country has a functioning one. This man will remain in power as long as he sees fit, unless the masses grow a set of balls and actually do something to remove him. Except, that didn't even work for Hong Kong. Better to just bring your own lube to these affairs now than to try to stop these dumb fuck rapists. LMAO, I love anal. Why would Reddit praise PT? This whole thread screams misinformation. The Workers' Party of Brazil, PT, the same people who ruined the country for 14 years having two elected presidents, Lula and Dilma. Lula got arrested for corruption and Dilma was impeached for corruption. Any dissent Brazilian is aware that it doesn't matter what president we have now and in the future, Bolsonaro or not, we can never listen to the Workers' Party, PT, ever again, they are thugs who stole our country's money, sent it to all the possible dictatorships around the world, lied about removing millions of people from extreme poverty, they never accomplished that and now are trying to use the pandemic to divide the country. You can downvote this as much as you want and I know that before I even submit this comment. I don't care about the karma. This is awful news for you I know you are upset to read this. I just wanna say that, whatever bots or information system you guys are using, to make it look like lots of Brazilians believe and support this gigantic bullshit, it's impressive, you are really good at this information war here, on Twitter and on WhatsApp. This is absolutely hilarious and I encourage anyone who isn't Brazilian here, if you can be bothered, to follow this up and see how it's gonna add up to nothing as even Lula, PT, himself has to go back to jail to serve the rest of this term. The Workers' Party is desperate, if anything, the Brazilians will impeach Bolsonaro if he really deserves to. We impeached President Kohler in 92, we impeached Dilma in 2016 and we will impeach Bolsonaro if it's necessary regardless of any ideology and no propaganda or opportunist group of politicians will make this happen. I don't agree with Bolsonaro's posture on many matters about the COVID-19 but most people here are not aware that people in Brazil are starving, the economic damage can be permanent and they think the country can stay home forever because they have their fridges and cabinets full of food bought with their parents' money. They don't work and don't understand the consequences, they spend all day on a sofa watching TV and tweeting. If people in Brazil don't die of COVID-19, they will die of starvation. Yes the virus is real and very serious, but we have to balance the risk with responsibility. Most countries are becoming more united because of this pandemic, they are displaying tenacity and compassion, Brazilians are doing that too and the groups who support this mentality, to use the pandemic as a political opportunity do not represent us. ITT foreigners who know fuck all about Brazilian politics, but can only mumble Bolsonaro bad so PT doing this should be good, right? The same commies that fucked up our country for 14 years. They hate anyone that isn't a leftard. Both parties are scum. Good. That guy is a nutcase. He's handled COVID-19 as poorly or more poorly than Trump, who backslash also backslash deserves to be impeached, again. The horror stories coming out of Brazil blow my mind. Got some backslash awesome backslash friends who are Brazilian expats and all they can do is shake their heads and what are you going to do? It's been this way forever. Damn. I hope it's successful. He's a foolish ass. I very much dislike Bolsonaro but god I hate PT too. Both got a GTFO. I dislike Bolsonaro and wish he wasn't president here, but I don't think Brazil should impeach him just for doing a bad job. If Brazil, and other nations, want to build strong democratic institutions then you have to have very strict rules on this sort of thing. 
impeaching presidents for doing a bad job will just lead to long-term instability as Brazil would have impeachments every year. Use the ballot box or propose impeachment for a high crime.